and schools in Indiana are facing increased pressure to fit academic requirements into the school day, and that's been cutting into recess time. But as WTIU's Emily Wright reports, a growing body of research supports the importance of recess. Research including neuroimaging, behavioral studies, and school performance has repeatedly pointed to recess helping in child development. Recess is child-driven. It's where they express themselves, where they learn to make choices that, that meet their needs for that day. Some days I want to run and play tag, some days I just want to be with my friends and chill. It's where they have an opportunity to guide their own experiences at school. But teachers and principals say it's hard to fit everything, including a state-mandated 90-minute reading period, into the school day. And that's why parents need to be aware of how their child's day is structured. I'm a parent and I know that I want to know about my child's day and talk with them about it and know what they're doing because it's important then to have a balance at night. You know, when you learn that your child is in 90 minutes of uninterrupted reading, sometimes they need to play before they do a little more reading at night instead of go right into reading. Indiana requires public elementary schools to provide students with five hours of instructional time each day. That cannot include time for recess or lunch. For WTIU News, I'm Emily Wright.